A speed skater makes a silver splash in his Olympic debut, and Canada's bronze medal cabinet is getting a little bit cluttered with another third-place finish in Beijing. 24-year-old Stephen Dubois won silver in the men's 1,500-meter short track event. The final consisted of 10 skaters due to penalty advancements in the semifinal races. Dubois needed one of those advancements, and he made the most of the opportunity, weaving his way through the big field and getting a spot on his first Olympic podium. I had a lot of doubts um, coming into the final. Uh, there was so many great skaters, but I think uh, having so many good skaters, it brought the best in me, and uh, that's why I got to skate uh, as good as I could, and uh, I got the silver medal, so I'd like to thank all my competitors that helped me uh, achieve what I did. BC snowboarder Marietta O'Dine captured bronze in women's snowboard cross earlier this morning. The 24-year-old suffered a concussion just before this event at the 2018 Games and was unable to compete in South Korea. She also broke her back in training in 2019. This performance was her redemption. Everything that I've been through in the past four years, I've always kept a strong head on my shoulders and to believe in myself that everything's going to come back around and you can achieve your goals. There's a controversy brewing in figure skating, specifically the mixed team event, where Canada finished fourth. The medal ceremony was postponed because of a dispute. Here's the explanation from the IOC. Uh, the situation arose today at short notice, which requires legal consultation with the ISU. You'll appreciate because there's legal implications involved in this, I can't really talk very much more about it at this stage. The Russian Olympic Committee won gold in the mixed team event. Russian athletes are competing as representatives of the ROC rather than Russia due to previous doping sanctions. Mike Arsenault, Global News.